Previously on Zakia Loves Pinto. Just have no shirt on. So that's interesting. But how I want to wear it, baby wouldn't let me. I love that she's unprotected with me. That's me right there. It's only right. You're going to get the funky smell. Ugh. Maybe not. You done got you a dope piece. Bags on bags on bags. <laughs> I feel like the bag lady right now, for real. You know the funny thing is, they don't ever give you like bags. They give you like trash bags, swap me bags. I'm like, thanks guys. I got more trash bags for the house now. How much is this? It's twenty five dollars. The last night it's strong. They don't have size, so you just got to size it. I think this might be. I mean, are you wearing this with like a sweatshirt on here, or are you wearing it with like a t-shirt? Oh, this would be cute with a thermal under it. Yeah, you got a big spot on it. You know what? You know what this is? I'm a negotiator. <laughs> I like a deal, and I actually, you know, when you come to places like this, like vintage places, secondhand, the the price is not final. Okay, you can always kind of wiggle and negotiate the price by a few dollars here and there. My strategy, be cute, <laughs> be girly, and um, don't stop until I get what I want. Really, that's my strategy, and if they don't give me what I want, I'm walking away. Bye, I don't need to give you my money. Sorry. Huh? How much are these? I wanted those pants. I want those pants. I'm gonna go back and get those pants. <laughs> but at that moment, I just could not fathom spending 60, 50 to 60 dollars on these pair of parachute pants. Parachute pants right now I can get on Sheen for ten dollars or less, six dollars. And it was just this quality and not really the quality, the uniqueness of these pants that I really, really liked. So but I just couldn't fathom paying that much, like, no. Especially because I don't even know what outfit I'm wearing with. Like, it would just be sitting in my closet for a little bit, so right now, it just was not the time to be spending unnecessary money. If he could've gave me it for $30, I would've bought it right away, like this. It's the end of the day! Yeah. Dang, not a 30 end of the day deal? I'm always in support of any time a deal is to be made. I mean, that's what you're supposed to do when you come to the flea market. You can't just come to the flea market and just buy anything at the price that they give it to you. It's really all about negotiating, you know? So, like, you got to be a negotiator when you're going to places like this. If you're not negotiating, then you're not shopping right. I'm just saying, you know, that's what the flea market is about. You're cutting a deal for an item that should probably be already cut. Being that she is negotiating with this dude, it's the end of the day, why not just cut her that end of the day deal? It just makes sense. Get that out of here. It's less low for you. All these shirts are free. So, you already know. Like, what, what are the odds? You get so lucky. You know, sometimes you might forget or you ain't thinking about all the blessings that you do have or the blessings that are put into your life. But when you get a little sweet blessing like this, it's like, I am blessed, for sure. We got some shirts off your hand. Thank you so right, much. Are you guys here so often? Yeah, I'm on this spot every month, like all year. Oh, hey, what's your name? Bro. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome, thank yeah. you so much. Yeah. We appreciate it. Right, for sure. We'll be we back can. for sure. Yeah. <laughs> 
actually know where it started at. And it felt like something was sitting on top of my head. Just one day, I started getting like this really bad headache. How come I have any stupid ass headaches? Are you serious? Um. Initially, of course, you're not gonna think that it's serious because you know sometimes you get random headaches and it's just that. Well, I've been having these really bad headaches. You know, it's been literally feeling like I have a book on top of my head. I think when it continued and she started to have these like headaches on the daily throughout the day, it was like, okay, let's see what's going on here. Have you called for the doctor? Have you set an appointment? Mm-mm. I'm gonna call him today. But you know, because my dad had a brain aneurysm. I did feel like dizziness a little bit here or there um, within the headaches while I'm having the headaches or whatever. I mean, but for the for at least a week and a half, it was constant. They wouldn't go away. It was just like my head was hurting constantly. Like I was like, I need some relief from this, but I wasn't getting any relief. So that's why I started doing like the ice, the ice packs to try to see because I looked up to see if you could put ice packs on your head or if that would work. Viv, click on. Wait, 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 wait. Come on, give it, give it, give it to me. That sounds amazing. I, I know what you're saying. What do they, what the fuck is called? The sense. Price is not, all right now, final. All right, so one thing, okay. Ah! Bye. Yeah, move your fine ass from here. Distraction. <laughs>